always was, always will be the lands of the First Nations people. As we celebrate NAIDOC week, we join together as a school and wider community to acknowledge the way the Indigenous people cared for the land and developed their knowledge, cultures and stories. We want all our students to respect the strong Indigenous culture and for our Aboriginal students to be proud of the rich culture they share with others. Kindergarten recognised NAIDOC week by participating in a variety of activities, both inside and outside of the classroom. To begin, they took an enjoyable walk over to Lake Wallace, where they visited and learnt about the platypus scar tree. The students viewed examples of Aboriginal artworks. They then used the technique of dot painting to create an artwork of platypus. In the afternoon, Miss Davidson, our school ASLO, presented a very informative and interactive talk about the Kulaman and Aboriginal hunting tools. This term, Stage 1, students have been immersed in a variety of Aboriginal culture experiences through our history, geography, creative arts and PE programs in order to gain a deeper understanding of our local Aboriginal history and culture to lead us into Native Week celebrations. From the, the beginning of the semester, we have fortnightly Wiradjuri language lessons taught by Mrs Davidson, our Aboriginal liaison officer. We have learned a variety of Wiradjuri phrases, greetings and words related to other learning areas such as maths, in particular how to say Wiradjuri numbers, names and positional words. Part of NAIDOC week celebrations, Stage 2 participated in learning and performing on interpretive hand dance to Yathu Yindi's Japana. Yiru do marang, good day. You will do cadence. My name is Cadence. Go and Bana, welcome to the Wairang Public School. I would like to acknowledge the Wiradjuri people whose traditional country this celebration is being held today. I would like to pay respects to the ancestors and elders past and present and extend that respect to all Aboriginal people presenting here today and acknowledge all involved in the creation of the Guga artwork. The Goanna is the tribal totem of the Wiradjuri Nation, the largest Aboriginal nation in New South Wales. Goanna is Guga in Wiradjuri language and its people are known as the Goanna people. In 2018, the students of the Guga group and school staff in consultation with the Aboriginal parent and community group of Wallerowin Public School decided that an Indigenous artwork would help to welcome Aboriginal people and all members of our school and wider community to our school. 
collaboration with Aboriginal parents and the school's resident potter, Mrs Pauline Welfare, in consultation with the local Aboriginal artist, Rick Slavin, the journey of our creation of the Guga began. Mrs Welfare worked tirelessly to ensure that each student, staff member and representatives from our Aboriginal parent and community body were given the opportunity to contribute to the Goanna mural. Whether it was carving a piece of the goanna out of the clay, or making and glazing a set of the tiny dots, or assisting with gluing the pieces onto the wall, everyone played a part. Along the way, a strange thing happened. When the goanna was fired, the glaze came out with an unusual texture resembling scale, which made it look more authentic. The result is this beautiful, truly unique pottery mural that represents the culture of the Wiradjuri people, the culture and tradition of Lerun Public School as culturally safe and also has the added feature of sensory stimulation with its tactile properties. It's a stunning feature of true community consultation and collaboration. In Stage 3, students have acknowledged the significance of NADOC Week through their work in science and technology their art as well on the Broken Bay excursion. In science, students learn how Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people use observations of the night sky to inform their daily lives. The students learned about the importance of celestial bodies such as the emu in the sky, the Milky Way, for the Wiradjuri people. This was for the purpose of hunting and season understanding. They also learned about other celestial bodies and their dreaming stories related to the Southern Cross and the shark in the sky from other Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander nations. During NADOC week, Stage 3 students contributed to class artworks on this year's theme, Always Was, Always Will Be. Students worked collaboratively to create a shared class artwork. We provide every opportunity at Willerowing Public School for our Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander students to achieve and be successful.